Why do atheists lie to themselves? An intelligent person will create a computer with its hardware and its software and even with artificial intelligence. But yet the atheist will deny that a human being who has DNA, a mind, a body and even free will, the atheist will deny that humans are a product of an intelligent creator. An intelligent person will also design and create a plane to fly in the sky. But yet the atheist will deny that creatures like the birds were created by an intelligent creator. An intelligent person will design and create a robotic hand. But yet the atheist will deny that something as complex as a human hand is the product of an intelligent mind. And so in the face of all the evidence that God exists and in the face of just plain common sense that every design has a designer, why do atheists deny the evidence? Why do atheists lie to themselves? Number one, atheists may experience cognitive dissonance. Cognitive dissonance is a mental conflict which occurs when current beliefs are contradicted by new information or when current wrong beliefs are contradicted by the truth. So in the case of the atheist, atheists believe that nothing made everything, which is a lie. Even though they don't have observable and testable evidence, they believe that all things are a product of evolution and not of intelligent design. And so when the atheist is confronted by the truth that the universe did not create itself any more than a building or an aeroplane would evolve or create itself, the tendency for the atheist is to lie to himself and deny common sense rather than accept the truth. The second reason why atheists lie to themselves is because atheists love the pleasures of sin. Atheists love the pleasures of sin so much that the possibility of being accountable for sin is something they would rather deny. This is why the atheist not only denies the existence of God, but the atheist will deny the existence of sin. And so by denying the existence of sin, atheists also deny the existence of good and evil. They would rather lie to themselves by denying the existence of sin or good and evil because admitting to the existence of sin would make them morally and spiritually accountable. Which brings me to the third reason why atheists lie to themselves. Atheists suppress God in their life. Think about it. Why do they try to convert religious people to atheism? Why do they attempt to mock God and Christianity? Why do they feel the need to oppose anything that resembles the values of God and Christianity? If God doesn't exist, why oppose him? In Psalms chapter 14 verse 1, it says, A fool says in his heart, there is no God. Now, that scripture isn't saying that the atheist can't think or that the atheist isn't intelligent. What that scripture is really pointing out is that how can a person deny God or the existence of God in the face of such evidence? In Romans chapter 1 verse 20, it says that no one is without excuse when it comes to the existence of God because nature itself and all of creation testifies that God exists. In Romans chapter 1 verse 22 it says claiming to be wise they became fools 
And so to the atheist, I would encourage you to rethink the idea that nothing can create something. Rethink the idea that the complexity of this universe and all that is in it was just a huge accident that resulted in nothing. To the atheist, I would say this, consider the existence of God. Amen. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel and get our latest videos.